Welcome back, everybody. As we continue our track through Assassin's Creed, as we play through Altair and even La Baja, we continue right after the first successful assassination to regain the honor and reputation of Altair. Now we shall meet You've done well, Al Muwalam. And I'm confident that this is but the first of many successes. Tamir spoke as if he knew you well. He implied my work had a larger meaning. Significance comes not from a single act, but the context within which it is performed. The consequences born of it. Then is there more I need to know? Altair, your greatest failure was born of knowing too much. If I choose to withhold information, it is only to ensure you do not make the same mistake a second time. I see. No, you don't. And it will remain this way until you've learned your lesson. Still, you have performed competently. And as such, I restore a rank and will return a piece of your equipment. Go now, either to Akka or Jerusalem. There are men in both cities who require your attention. The bureau leaders can tell you more about what needs to be done. Well, I don't know. I haven't decided as to where I'm going to go yet. Now that we've gotten a short blade back, another little notch on my health bar, I feel pretty good. I don't know where to go though. Oh, uh, haven't decided. Oh, I've I've got counter kill. Yes, counter kill is back. Oh, that's perfect. Counter kill. He's gone mad. God save him. He's gonna match up. Altair, it seems my students do not fully understand what it is to wield the blade. Perhaps you could show them what you know. Oh, great. Another person wants me to help them. Now, do a counter attack. Perfect. Yes, perfect. Come on, boy. Yep. And we'll do one more, and then we'll end it. And that, my students, is how we all should fight. That, my students, is how we all should fight. Capture the infidel! Yes. Anyway. Yes. Very, very, very busy. Anyway, excuse me. How do you get out of here? Oh, crap. Anyway, as I was saying, as we continue our journey through Assassin's Creed, I think we're gonna go off to the holy land of Jerusalem. No. Instead, no, we're gonna save Jerusalem for last. We're gonna go to Acre. 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 Whatever the name of that place was. That's where we're gonna go. Um. Why do I wanna save Jerusalem for last? Well, if you know anything about the Crusades, Jerusalem was a major fighting spot where a lot of people fought for the Holy Lands since it was so big and this is kind of the thing that we're following here I, I, I just feel like it should be known waiting and waiting because usually I'm pretty sure that was one of the last battles that was fought during the Crusades was over uh what you call it over Jerusalem and I mean my history of which isn't as good as my Greek mythology but hey it's pretty decent uh, but I'm in a good mood um, as a senior if you talk to a lot of dudes well not even a lot of dudes, a lot of people a lot of uh, grown people who you know lived their life and went through high school but I tell you senior year is comprised of uh, three things prom football season and basketball season and you know for me, time has always been one of those things that scared me. Why? Because it was one of those absolutes. No matter what you did, time is not going to wait. It's not going to slow down. It's not going to speed up for you. And right now, seeing years going by pretty dash going fast. Um, you know, football season is what, just about up. Um, and then we're about to kick in the basketball season. Right after that, we're going to hit prom. It is wise to leave the area. And it's, it, it, it's a amazing process as I, I, 
It's that printing in applications for schools and blah 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 blah. And yeah, yeah. first, let's decide where we're gonna go. So that's Damascus, and this is Acre. I think we're gonna go Acre. So where is he going? Wait. Wait. Okay. Just want to make sure I was no, you idiot. <laughs> Want to make sure I'm in the right spot. No, we're gonna go fast. Where am I running from? Shut up. Anyway, uh, as I was saying, it's just one of those. It's an experience, and as you go through it, it's it's kind of scary. But uh, I've never been a ladies' man per se. But for me. To already have prom dates, you know, possibilities lined up, I feel real good. So now, you get away. I kind of feel like, yes. No! My horse! You die. I told you you would die. Ha! <laughs> I'll stalk you like a pig, son! Come on! Who else wants some? You fool! Oh, a Templar! Get away! Watch your men die before you, Templar! I wish I had the grab counter. <laughs> Who's next? Don't you run away, fool. Templar scum. Okay, you and this grabbing. Oh, I'll stalk you like a pig! Oh, wait. It didn't show him as a Templar. Oh, man. He wasn't a Templar. That's kind of discouraging. But anyway, as I say, not being a ladies' man at all, having that already, I'm, I'm confident now. Oh, throughout school and all that good stuff. Oh, I was always well. It was difficult, I should say, just difficult. Oh. A lot of the girls that I used to talk to, wanted to talk to, I was not, uh, I was, I guess the word should be attractive enough. I wasn't attract attractive enough for them. And as such, it was like, oh man, the people I want to be with don't want to be me, and it's a disheartening thing. Everyone who's ever had to deal with it knows how disheartening oh, that can be. But, like I said, I just feel better. Oh, uh, I'm very confident. Like, what was it, Friday? I was extremely mad Friday. Uh, like, really, really, really mad. And I had wanted to record. It's so funny. I had wanted to record, but it was like I had to upload some videos, so I couldn't record. But I had really wanted to record, because I had wanted to vent and stuff and just get my frustrations off cause oh uh, just a little bit into it I took AP Biology in school in school I took it I took it as a junior so right now as a senior I take AP Calculus um uh, so it is this group of uh, some of my old friends and I guess I should really say associates and not friends but they take AP Biology now and it's like, they are making the class, they make it seem like this class is so much harder than it really is. And it's like, that's annoying to me. Uh, and it's like, they're doing that. And you know, I understand it's not easy. I don't like biology, so yeah, it's difficult for me. However, it's just like, if I could deal with it, y'all can deal with it. And I also take a broadcasting class. It's kind of what helped me get into the whole YouTube thing. Or learning how to do certain things in that class. 
and it's like die heathen okay you want to die oh really we're gonna be doing that cheap crap eh well you scottish jerk Sweet, come on. You down, dog. You fool. I hate when they try and roar. Like, that would be, like, real funny. In real life, dude tries to attack you. She roar. Like, you, he roars away from you. But let's just take him to... Let's just take him to the beauty of Akra. Oh, great. As I was saying, no, I think I can kill you, bro. You go down, and you take some. You're dead. Stalks you like a pig, too. Oh, come on, you idiots. You know you can't kill me. Yeah. Yeah. Like, you would wonder, like, out of all of these people, why haven't they started? AI does get better, thank God. Okay, you call back up. You, you die. You, you. But you would figure that they would all attack at once. And you know it's just the first game. AI ain't all that great yet. But... Plus, you gotta realize that would be game breaking if every woman, if every one of them decided to attack. But after you saw this and you, your friends get dropped, would you really keep fighting? This one dude has cleared out. How many dead bodies is on the ground? Like you really? He, I wouldn't even fight these people no more. <sighs> it is funny. They say one of the creeds is never to compromise the brotherhood. But I go out, balls to wall, attack it, just whatever, and leave all of these dead bodies. Like, all of these dead bodies now. And then I'm about to go up. This is why I die. Man. Come on, come on. You? Come on, come on. All I have is a little dagger. Shoot! Oh, oh. Nope. Oh. Oh. Ow. That must have hurt him. I wish I could saw it. But... Oh. Do your gullet. I can't get your other guy because he ran away, but... Oh, I think that's the coward. I really hate that. When they run away. Like... Oh, no. This is that one place I hate. Everyone's all poor and sick and hungry. And then everyone gets in the way because they're sick and they're weeping. And... Oh, here's another thing. Next game I'm playing... Uh, it won't be Assassin's Creed 2, um, even though I'm going to be going straight into God of War 2. Peasant. Peasant. I am not a peasant. As I was saying. Uh, even though I'm going to be jumping straight into God of War 2, I won't be jumping straight into Assassin's Creed 2. Instead, I'm going to play another Assassin's game. Um, I'm going to be playing uh, Dishonor. So hopefully that is a good choice. But just to quickly wrap up my, you know, how it's my story. So, they was, you know, they talking about how they, whoa, 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 whoa. How they had their issues, you know, because the class was this, that, and the other. But it was like, I have 
a broadcasting class with them, and it's like, okay, well, I don't mind you having to go out to do what you have to do for the other class. That's fine. You know, I can only actually do so much. But, pause, audio volume. Oh, that's me. Audio is such a difficult thing, and I work with audio. I probably said this before. I work with it in class. It's just so difficult to manage. Because what I hear and what's getting picked up is so different. Anyway, as I was saying, uh, start doing the. Well, actually, well, yeah. We'll just start doing the assassin uh, stuff. But. So it was difficult. I understand them doing that, but it's like, okay, at least ask me, you know, at least, well, not ask me, but at least tell me so I know I can get, get things set up by myself and get everything in order, because I may have stuff that I want to do, too. I'm working on some stuff for YouTube in between classes, lunch hours, you know, stuff like that, and it's like, that becomes second nature to them. But, Say I hate those, and then it's not like Assassin's Creed 2 where you can just like, what's the just throw money, like you can't just throw money. I wish you could, cause if you could, it would be perfect, but you can't. I'm pretty sure those two are the ones that we have to eavesdrop, so I'm just gonna blend right past them. Oh, uh, and then sit, and then lock on those two. Listen. You hear about Elaine? The archer who guards the eastern wing. Poor bastard's brother caught an arrow in the throat. Doubt he'll last the night. How can he continue to work knowing what's to come? He visits his brother often, so I cover for him when I can. You aren't there now? No. I family business of my own to attend to. Then he'd best hope the doctor doesn't learn of his desertion. He won't. Long as you stay silent. Don't worry. Your secret's safe with me. Excuse me. But as I was saying, uh, find this new viewpoint. So we'll go over there. But um, I don't mind. I, I, I've left out the class. Uh, so I, I've had, you know, I understand what it's like that to get something new. I've left out the class to do stuff. But I told them, and that's my main issue. And when I came back, I helped. And that's another thing that makes me mad. Because when they came back, they did not want to put in no type of work. And that's the one thing that I don't like. Above all else, is a lazy nigga who don't want to put in work. But no, he got to put in work. It's like, no, you got work to do. You, like, no, you have to do something. But you don't want to help when you get back here. Because somebody else took all the work for you. And I'm like, I asked them for help. And they did like that. Girl. Which made me mad. And, uh, it's funny because, like, the day before, like, literally, the day before, they was all, come on, well, not all of them. But one of them was like, oh, come on, help me. I need help. I need help. Help me because I need. I got a test. I didn't want to read the book. He was like, okay, well, she helped. Well, that gave me away. She helped me, so I'll help her. It's understandable. I like doing that. I, You know, you give, you take. It's balance. So I was like, all right, I'll help her. And it's funny because it was me and this other girl talking. And, you know... Basically, it's a girl I used to talk to. Was trying to get on with, trying to get in a relationship with. Didn't work, and she likes to. She's an asshole for it, cause she knows. Oh. She knows how I feel about her, so she keeps something about how she's gay and bi. The girl is kind of freaky, but still, she know she does it mainly because I hate it. Oh. So if I had to give any advice to any other person who's nice, who watches this stuff, if you're in high school, don't be too nice. I know what it's like. Uh, 
you want to be nice, you want to be different, you want to be kind. Excuse me for a second. 